how are you? And welcome to the White Heather Club. And tonight we've got a special late license. Good evening, Joe. Good evening, Andy. Singing? Yes, yourself? I don't mind if I do. She gets to the streets of Whitefish for the buy. Louis and Claire, he heard the speech and he followed her on the fly. Reggae do dum day, do dum day, reggae do dum day. To see him bound for Glasgow soon, and I'm hoping you'll gang with me. I'll meet you by the lake to the moon, and fine we'll marry it be. Reggae do dum day, do dum day, reggae do dum day. To see him up there, I'll lock the door and the mother keep the key. I'm getting all wealthy while you last, I can never win to pay thee. Oh, I will get a ladder long and a creel of bad good three. And we're off to the chimney top of Lowry's to see thee. Hey, good day, good day, good day, good day, good day, good day. Well, the old wife couldn't sleep that night, so late it was the hour. I'll leave my life to the silly old wife for someone in the dock. Yeah, good day, 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 good day. Her bed, she feared for her in cell. When what a lark, when she took the dark and into the cream she fell. Reggae do dum day, do dum day, reggae reggae do dum day. No, the wind was clear, get the jam lights up when he felt that the gale was full. He ran the rope with his elbow and passed it to him, he drew. Reggae do dum day, do dum day, reggae reggae do dum day. He stowed her up, he stowed her down, and he let the creel do fall. Well, Joe, are you dancing? No. How about you? No. Mr. Mr. Watson! You lazy fear. <laughs> That lad would have made. <laughs> well, green grow the rashes, oh, green grow the rashes, oh, the happiest tools that ever spent, well, etc., etc., etc. What's happening now? Well, Laura Brand's going to sing, and uh -huh. we're going to sing with her. Tell her Mac do. Singing song. Oh, I better get ready. <laughs> Queen of fate, 
but tis to say, this year next a merry day. When will you come my way? Oh, tell me truly, we Tell me you're living here now. That is correct. You see, the situation of our damage in the capital was perfect, except for the prodigious expense of energy dissipated in my over-frequent visit to this west coast of metropolis. You're joking. He says he's living in Glasgow now because it's cheaper. Oh! <laughs> Good morning, in and him come he, and there is so saddle horse for me, who should be? How come this horse here, oh, how can this be? Oh, how come this horse here, who to leave of me? He blend all those and buddies, mother of me, she be, his name is but a milk coo, my mommy sent to me. For he are written, and muckle he has seen, but saddles on a milk coo, store never made. In and him come he, and there he got a pair of bits for me, but should be. How come these bits here, oh, how can this be? Oh, how come these bits here with good to leave of me? He blend all those are funny, I'm coupling a seat. It's but a pair of water stick, my mommy said to me. For he are written, and muckle he has seen, but still are for the water stick, so I never did.
James. Well, Andy. Well, we're both well, well. Yeah. Ah, that's a lovely instrument. It is, isn't it? No fee. Oh, well, I see your respect for the public. Here is James Urquhart to sing for you, the last of Glen Shee. <laughs> Bright is the gold on the bonny broom bushes that girdle the banks and the green braes o' Glen and clear run the waters through fair flowery meadows, the scenes that are joy and contentment to me. Say, lacked is my hair to meet such splendor and beauty, and gay is my step as I walk o'er the lee. For I see the sweet face of the maid I love dearest, the floor of my bosom, the last of Glen Tunes o' the lowlands the lads are beguiling, but let them be seeking the pleasures that be. They can not the peace that my in heart can treasure when herding my cry on the praise o' Glen She. Sing wild eagle lark in the blue of the morning, the joy of the heart that is a happy and free. For you sing for oh, the love that I have for my dearie, the floor of my very nice to welcome another violinist to the program. It's always nice to have two bows to your string. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean by two bows? Oh, I beg your pardon. I forgot that Ian Powdery plays the violin too, slightly. Man, you're in an feel, Andy. <laughs> <laughs> so I am, Ian. <laughs> Here is Mr. McAndrew to play for you. Who? Hector. That's better. Aye, aye. Aye, ciao, now. Thank you. 
find this quite interesting. It's a Scottish poem of Scottish character about a sermon in a kirk, and it's called Time Wars. Time Wars! In the garlic he thundered, with the air full of store for the bras that his twa knees had dunted for more than an hour. But the women of this congregation could sit on their hair, and he's in like a glad seek at our gate, for shingle teeth there, regardless of Paul's holy like he on earlier left. But no, they would no find it easy to sit on their skirts. <laughs> the kirk skilt and travelling him one with Sabbath like peace. While the men said the words of the preacher were pang full of grace, the women of that congregation, gay, mem, mood, and grim, at the back of the minds, were not thinking, say, Mako or him. As I come in by ice and side, where swiftly flows the rolling tide, a fair young maid passed by my side, she looked at me and smiled. She was a maid of beauty brick, as ever trod the breeze of geck. I could have spent the lilang next with her and I and side. So I turned my back on five his bells and my poor head gave money an L. I speared the road to St. John's Wells with courage stout and bold. The maid she turned without delay and thus to me began to say, I've scarce twelve miles to go this day, young man, I'll tell ye plain. Inside where swiftly flows the rolling tide A fair young maid passed by my side She looked at me and smiled She was a maid of beauty brick As ever trod the breeze of geck I could have spent the lilang next With her and I and side Couple, they've got married new, and they've got bernies one or two, and as much land as keeps a coo on Bonnie Ithan side. Oh, Blythe is the little to his ain mother tongue. To the exile who's long been a roving It I brings to mind the old songs that were sung Brunt his feathers fireside at the gloaming It brings back the scent of the heavenly praise The sound of the newborn is He follows the plough or the harrow, the 
borderless sings it in strain sweet or sad by the banks of the Etric or Yarrow. What though in the heart of the great we may meet, we may know high rank and broad, perhaps I for him and in music say sweet as the soft lull and tongue of a One. They're both musicians. I give in. <laughs> I won't do it again, I promise. Right. Now let's hear your promise. <laughs> The ball I ye mind at the wheel, ye danced to any less than the three. If that's no enough for to cause me to grieve, when ye can ye are promised to me. Ye can ye are promised. I can I am promised. Ye I can. can I Promise to me. Here is the ring that you gave me a for. I'll wear it no longer above. I can get a lad of gifts as all day as his bed. I am dusty when we are a war. Will you talk back the ring, Jenny? Talk back the ring. You may get other fish in the sea, but you'll ne'er get a lad that will know ye as weel when ye ken ye were promised to me. Ye ken ye are promised. I ken I am promised. Ye ken ye are promised to me. The ring to me, tack it again, for oh, it would grieve me for sair. And to death to a pest, it will rain in my head, and Jimmy will quarrel me And no, ye are mine, Jesse, no, ye are mine. It's happy through life we shall be. Until death, dear, the pet, ye shall reign in my heart. For ye can, ye are promised to me. Ye can, ye are promised.
again to the White Heather Club until we see you all the same time, same place next week from all of us here. Good night, good luck, and peace, your bar, will